Welcome, I'm looking as I said and you will become uh, to remember as just a nice new shuttle by looking at all three to look at the other ships that we have available. Pretty much. I probably don't have any ships available for you, but I can provide information on what would you like. Uh, tell me about shuttles. Oh, nice one. Lock achievement. Uh, welcome, I'm looking to thank you. Quite a ship of different ship types. Tell me cruisers. Looks like you're all set. Hey, don't keep the Admiral waiting. Nice. Okay, what's your now? This way. Yeah. Okay. Away for Tilly. Come on, Tilly. Let's go. the park. Why not? This way. Yeah. The Admiral's office is this way. Let's wait some. Okay, Admiral. Congratulations on your promotion. I will let you know when I have a new task for you. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, so, you received 260 XP, uh, 65 XP, uh, phaser, and a battery pack. Nice. You survived! Then again, you survived Yay. fighting House Mokai. Admiral Kensington must have been a walk in the park for you. I guess this is goodbye. At least for now. Oh. You've got a ship and a crew to take care of, and I, well, I still have to graduate. Hey, do you mm. think they'll use your ship for the cadet cruise next year? If they do, put in a good word for me. Okay, I'll see what I can ah, do. Ah, great. <laughs> hey, I liked being your chief engineer out there. It, uh, it would be an honor to do that again. Captain. Oh man, this is hard. Uh, stay safe, okay? This war won't last forever. And I hope we're both doing what Starfleet does best soon. Exploring the galaxy, strange new worlds, all that. Yeah, uh, same here. Take care of yourself. Oh, and just like that, she was gone. Right. I have a mission for you. Oh. Uh, the place we are the possible. The plausibility of the possible. Our victory at Pryor's World was hard fought, and we took a thrashing in the process. We've gained some momentum from this win, but our position at Pryor's could become tenuous if the Klingon should return for a rematch. 
Captain Gabriel Lorca of the USS Buran is on station at Pryor's World, and he's requested assistance while they handle mop-up operations there. I believe you and your crew are ready for action, yes? Lorca is uh -huh. a fine captain, tough but fair, with years of experience in the field. Follow his lead and you'll do well. Report to him at Pryor's World for further instructions. Kensington out. Mm. Will do. I have a mission for you. I want you at Pryor's World as soon as you're able. I don't have anything okay. for you right now. Right, okay. Um, do, do. Beam up, I guess. Beam me up. You are now in sector space. Here, ships travel at warp speed between systems. Combat does not take place in sector space. Right, got that. So we gotta go. Walking through the galaxy as our sun. Uh, it's not a bad game, this. No, uh, not played it before, but yeah, it's free on the Games Pass, so I thought I'd give it a go. Forever. God, are we there yet? Oh, I wish this ship could go quicker. And do, do, do. Right, while we're warping there, let's have a look. Better to have a photon torpedo or kill the beam. Uh, I'm not too sure. Let's have a look. We got. Oh, oh, hello. Shield battery, we can equip that. Nice. And a weapons battery. Nice. That. That. So we've got a, a little shuttle. Uh, finish with an array. So we put that.
30 got rifle. Give him one of them. Got one. Not me. Um. Well, it's the same what I've already got, isn't it? That's fine. Oh, there we go. Am I here? Just like that. Entering the uh, process, uh, we picked up extra supplies at the last star base for delivery here. Uh, the Shino and the Saita, I've made that up now, are expecting us. Uh, we should probably deliver the supplies uh, first since she's closer. Helm input coordinates and rendezvous with our allies. This is the USS Cicada. Switch to frequency 228.7 to adjust for ion storm interference. This is the Shinano. Advise keeping shields up. Cloaked Klingon vessels are still testing our defenses. So what do we do? Do we just get close and... Ah, here we go. Deliver the supplies. Let's do this quickly. Don't want our shields down for long. Thanks. Our supplies were low after retaking Pryor's world. One more assault and we would have been at critical levels in several key resources. I expect the Cicada is waiting for supplies too. I hope you have what they need. We do. We have a bunch of hardware for them. We're heading to them right now. Alright, where is she? Ah, there she's there. Lowering shields now. We are ready to receive supplies. Engineering yep. has confirmed that all expected hardware has been delivered. Thank you. We shall begin repairs at once. Our computer systems have received significant damage from Klingon assaults. I believe the Baran is waiting for you to report in, so I will keep you no longer. Understood. Nice. So, where is the... Back around. Mm. Ah, there. Full impulse. This is Commander Ellen Landry of the USS Buran. Welcome to Pryor's World. Commander, where is Captain uh, Lawson? The captain has requested that you transport over to the Buran to speak in person. Truth mm -hmm. be told, we're not certain our hailing frequencies are completely secure. It's, um, it's a long story. Let's just say the Klingons had a few tricks up their sleeve during battle. Understood. Captain Death out. Uh, why not? Let's go. Let's launch the mission and beam over. Oh, nice to finally meet you face to face. I'm Captain Gabriel Lorca. Welcome to the Baran. 
This is my first officer, ah. Commander Ellen Landry. Sorry to hear about Captain Schaefer. He was one of our best. Agreed. A damn fine captain. Though from what we've heard about what happened to Corvan, his ship's in good hands. Ah, and my somewhat tardy Chief of Security, Omna Patel. Uh, apologies, Captain. Welcome aboard. We appreciate the assistance. Engineering is this way, if you'll follow me. What took you so long? Ah, <sighs> you try booking a reception hall during prime wedding season. <laughs> I'm lucky to be alive. My warrior. Braver than a hundred Klingons. Kabla! We better catch up. Uh, before the captain throws us in the brig with the Klingons. Right, um... We've been mopping up here after our scrap with the Klingons. The Klingons did not surrender Pryor's world lightly. Cleaning up the planet-based missile launchers was satisfying. The Baran is currently holding some Klingon prisoners of war. Prisoners we plan to deliver to a secure location before we ran into a snag. Lieutenant Kerwin, oh. I have someone I'd like you to meet. Okay, welcome aboard. Thanks for lending us a hand. Mind taking a look at something here? I'm analyzing some issues with the Baran's critical systems, and a fresh perspective might shed some light. What's happening, Lieutenant? Somehow the Klingons infected our computer systems with a particularly nasty virus during the battle. Another house Mokai trick by the looks of it. It's in several key systems, sensors, shields, weapons. Ugh. Right now, we can't rely on any of those remaining at operational status. If they come back for a rematch, we could wind up blind and defenseless. All right, I'll check out the weapons. Uh, the virus has really dug into our tactical systems. We lose targeting, can't even power up the emitters or launchers. At that point, the only weapon in our arsenal is harsh language. And that won't go very far in a fight with the Klingons. <laughs> Their entire language is harsh. Okay, let's see what we're dealing with. Uh, aha, up here. tries to lock out a weapon, they should still work. Right, okay. Let's have a look at this. Should we get another little puzzle to solve? Ah, okay, yeah. Nice work. Tactical will need to make adjustments, but that should block the virus nicely. <laughs> that didn't do it. Okay. What the? We just lost port deflectors! 
Bridge to Captain. Klingon vessel decloaking. Lorca to bridge. I'm on my way. Captain, internal sensors show multiple Klingon transporter signals in your vicinity. All hands, repel borders. Lorca to bridge. We need those shields back. Do what you can to keep our port side away from the Klingons. Kerwin, I want you to head up there and give them a hand with the shields. Are we staying in engineering? No, I think it's time we went on the offensive. Landry, Patel, lead the way. Understood. Chief, get us to the armory. On it. Captain to sick bay. We have wounded on deck 17. We're on our way, Captain. Take one of these phaser rifles. We just finished modifications on them from data we gathered during the Priors World fighting. The Klingons are in for a little surprise. Oh, nice work, Ensign. Bridge to Captain. The Klingons hit the brig and released their buddies. Looks like they're heading oh. toward the shuttle bay. They're gonna make a break for it, sir. So Look at a bridge. Acknowledged. Operation. We're en route. To Pev, Landry, Patel, take the lead. Everyone else, you're with me. Let's move. On your six, Captain. Four. Do that. Let's see whether we can whip. Aha, uh -huh. oh yeah, Mark. Oh, gosh, we we'll have that. And then. She's got a rifle. Let's give him. Let's give him that. Go. Okay. Let's switch way now. This way. Why am I leading the way when it's their ship? Uh, this way? Oh, nice. Captain had other ideas. Nice shot back there. Glad you had our backs. We need to move. Can you stand? Mm. No, I'll manage. 
It's not as bad as it looks. are starting to open. Oh, it's that damned That's Klingon right. virus again. Bridge, this is the captain. Prepare the tractor beam in case we fail. even in the door systems. I'll handle this. Bam! Got it! This way? No. Oh. The car to the track. We're preparing to depart to the garage. Prepare for our arrival. Not today. Not on my ship. Change your plans. Show their captain. Then we leave. You'll have to get through me first! Die. Is that the more... Lord, get a bridge. The prisoners are secure. Give me a status report. Sir, the Klingon vessels just went under cloak. They'll be back. Count on it. We need to get the Klingon prisoners secured. Unfortunately, our holding facilities here are compromised. Under the circumstances, I think we'll need to transfer the prisoners to your ship. Okay, the Death 2 is ready to assist you, Cap. I think you'll agree we can't risk dropping our shields to use the transporters. You'll have to take a shuttle. It's a little old-fashioned, but if the Klingons are here to rescue their people, they won't risk firing on you. Your ship, on the other hand, will be a target. Be ready for anything. Agreed. We'll be ready, Cap. All right, these Klingons wanted a ride in a shuttle. Load them up. My team will handle the prison transfer to your vessel. I'll have our security chief contact yours to sort out the details. Very well, Commander. Excellent. Are you ready to finish boarding procedures and head out? Yes, and thank you. Good, you made it. Afraid I have some bad news. We're picking up some photon decay heading our way. My people believe it's coming from cloaked Klingon vessels, and I'm inclined to agree. Get ready for a fight. Understood, Captain. All hands, battle stations. All ships, deep close. Oh, 
All ships circle the wagon. Watch out for each other. We'll get through this. That one. Nice work, Captain. Looks like the Klingons aren't finished with us at Pryor's world. Glad you were in the neighborhood. Things could have gone pear-shaped if you weren't. I'll pass that along to start. I'm sure that'll look good in your after-action report. Might put a little dent in my sterling reputation, but I'll manage. That said, we're not out of the woods just yet. I'll let my first officer fill you in on the details. Understood, Captain. This is Landry. As you've seen, the Baran is needed here at Pryor's World, and her brig is no longer secure. I'm afraid your ship is going to have to facilitate this prison transfer. <laughs> Understood. What's the destination? The destination is classified, I'm afraid. I have the coordinates in a secure device, which, with your permission, I'll bring aboard with my team. Hmm. This is somewhat a regular commander. I don't disagree, Captain, but we're at war. Things have a tendency to get irregular in situations like this. Some of our prisoners are high-ranking members of the House Mokai. The secrets they know are important to the Klingons, even more so to Starfleet. We need to get them into a high-security facility as soon as we can. Right. Understood, Captain. I'd like to send Commander Landry and a team with you to assist on this call it a joint effort but it's still your ship and your command agreed agreed we'll make it happen we'll make it happen Captain. oh and one last thing Landry's on loan she's a damn fine officer and one of a kind I do expect her back intact as soon as you're done captain the shuttle on the other hand you can keep we got plenty of those mm, nice of course we'll see you soon Death two out. Warp two. My team is on board, Captain. With your permission, I'll take the helm for this trip. I know the way, after all. 
Understood. Take us out. Engage. Always wanted to say that. We've arrived at the coordinates, Captain. We're being hailed. Okay, on screen. Your presence in this system is unexpected. Transmit secure clearance codes now. Warden Voska, we're here Awaiting to- Awaiting transfer of codes. I should remind you that all of our defense systems are active, Captain. Vosker out. Did he just hang up on us? That he did, Captain. Shall I transmit the security clearance codes? It's that or navigate that defense code. I suppose... Send the codes. Transmitting initial sequence... Now. Lieutenant Kerwin, begin beta security code transmission on my mark. Mark. I see the... I see they like... their security protocols here, Commander. Very much so, Captain. Possibly more than they enjoy oxygen and comfortable socks. <clears throat> Transmission complete. The station is hailing us now. Shall I put them through? Please do, Commander. You're cleared for approach. Proceed to the following coordinates and prepare for prisoner transfer via shuttlecraft. Vosker out. All right, Hal. Proceed to those coordinates. A word? It's about Warden Vosker. What's on your mind? I've served with him before, and there are some things about his character you should be aware of. What y'all? Serving here allows Vosker to use methods and practices that would not fly on a starship. Some of his morals are fluid, perhaps dangerously so. Look, I'm not sure what Starfleet Command knows about him, but he still has command of the facility. Permission to speak freely? Francis. There are those in Starfleet who are more focused on results than the cost of achieving those results. Vosker is such a man. The Admiralty didn't order these prisoners here by chance. They want Vosker to get results by any means necessary. That doesn't work for me, or Captain Lorca. The ends do not justify the means. I intend to make sure the price we pay here isn't too great. I don't want to look back on this day with regret, or worse. Very well. Thanks for the heads up, Commander. My team has the prisoners prepped for transfer. Are you ready to head to the facility? Ready. Energize. Welcome to Facility 2047. I'm Hadrian Vosker. Computer, update the log to finalize the transfer of prisoners to this facility. Authorization Vosker Sigma 9. We'll take it from here. A reminder, all data relating to this facility is classified. Now, if there's nothing else, I have a prison to run. Feel free to show yourselves out. One moment, Warden. Commander Laundry. Uh, Laundry would like a Thank word. you. Hadrian, it's been a long time. 
not long enough. Was there anything of substance you wish to discuss? Or are we done here? Warden, we want to ensure that the prisoners are treated properly. As in, according to Starfleet regulations, Hadrian. Not your own personal code of conduct. Listen, we don't have to like each other. In fact, I'm pretty sure that's an impossibility at this point. What we need to do is work together and upholding the ideals and laws of the Federation. Are you finished? Look, the Federation is the promise of a better future. I buy into that. Beautiful dream. People love to talk about it. What nobody wants to talk about are the hard choices it takes to make that dream come true. Every day, the Klingons remind us, though. And we pay the price in blood, sweat, and tears. So unless you're ready to learn some hard truths, I suggest you return to your ship and move along. I think that we need to see some of these hard truths, Commander. Yeah, why don't you show us everything you do here, Warden? Enlighten us. Show us how you're keeping the Federation safe from all enemies, foreign and domestic. Hey, we'll even take notes. We're ready when you are, Warden. Wonderful. The prisoners are being processed. I'm sure they're being treated well. Better than the Klingons treated the innocent civilians of Pryor's world, for example. If you'll follow me. Lead the way. Johnson, give me a status report. Wrapping it up now, sir. Medical scans and contraband search all came back in the green. Warden? There's increased comms from the Starfleet vessel stationed at Pryor's world. It sounds like there's another fight with the Klingons there. What's the situation? Are they requesting support? I'm uh, not sure. Sorry, the signal's garbled. Some sort of interference is breaking it up, and I'm just getting fragments. So far, it sounds like the trouble is on the planet's surface. Any thoughts, Commander? We have our orders, and no distress signal is being sent. That being said, I'd feel a hell of a lot better if I were back on the Baran, Captain. I've got the feeling the Klingons are about to make another big push at Pryor's world. Understood. We'll get you back to the Baran as soon as we're done here. Fine. In the meantime, we have a job to do here. Johnson, put the Priority 2 prisoners into Genpop. I'll make sure our Priority 1 guest gets into MacSec where he belongs. Captain, Commander, Let's get this over with. Well, right behind you, Got Oscar. A nice cell waiting for you, Mokai. Move! I'm not sure leaving the prisoners here with him is wise, Commander. What are you hens clucking about back there? Just wondering what you have in mind for our prisoners, Hadrian. Nothing the Admiralty hasn't authorized before. Johnson here. Operations reports a malfunction in primary systems and recommends a reboot. Johnson, contact engineering. Be good. And keep an eye on things until I'm finished. Oscar to engineering. The bridge to isolation is acting up. Fix it. Now. Finally. Now deal with these malfunctions. Deflector grid just went offline. Look out, Klingons! Help. Nope. Johnson, initiate full lockdown. Get those shields back up now. Johnson, come in, Johnson. Damn, cross off. Coming for you. Are you ready? Let's get this over with. Tachek! <laughs> nice. Same to you, Haribach. <laughs> Come on! Stupid piece of work! 
Damn it! Problem, Hadrian? <laughs> it doesn't work, is it? I can't get the bridge to extend! We need to think of an alternative. Oh. That didn't Run alert! We need to get out of here right now! Let me help you! Hurry! You don't have time for this! Let him fall! It's just a Klingon! We are our fleet! Since you've obviously forgotten, that is not how we operate. Whatever. Let's get moving. Prisoners. Oh, sugar. Do your job. 
job, idiots. I can't get this done if they keep shooting me. Celebrations. Long range sensors are picking up a Klingon battle group approaching at high warp. Without the turrets, they'll eventually knock our shields down and finish us off for good. It's only a matter of time. Laundry, any thoughts? Lieutenant Kerwin can get those turrets back online. We just need to buy him enough time to get the job done. Then we'll return to the death. Um, by the, uh, and buy him some this time. This isn't time for heroics. One ship against a Klingon fleet? That's suicide, and you know it. Uh, face it, we're done here. Let's get essential personnel to your ship and get the hell out of here while we're able. I'm not letting this uh, I'm not letting this facility. Oh, it's prisoners Captain, fall. The turret grid just came back online. Wait. Bad. The turrets are scanning for Starfleet vessels. They've been sent to see them as targets. It's that damned virus. Lieutenant, I need you to get those turrets back on our side. It's just like what happened to Pryor's world. They turned our own defense grid against us and then mopped up what was left after the chaos. We'll just have to stick close to the station and stay out of the crosshairs. How did a Klingon virus get into our system? Klingons didn't even know about this place until... Until we brought the prisoners aboard. Of course. Those clever bastards. It's a genetic sequencing virus. We did a full medical scan of the Klingon prisoners when we brought them aboard the Buran. And 
another one when they were brought aboard this facility. But... We never did a medical scan aboard my ship. Fortunately, or your ship would be dealing with the virus too. Somehow they've managed to embed it within the DNA of one or more of the prisoners. If we can identify the difference between the artificial and natural bases, we should be able to isolate the viral code and purge it from the system. Good work, Lieutenant. How much time do you need? Maybe five minutes? Mm. Alright. Make it happen. Everyone else, back to the shore. Anything he does from here on out is on me. Don't blame yourself. You shouldn't beat yourself up for doing the right thing here. Besides, if we get him and Jaula, we can just pretend it was all part of the plan, right? Hmm. Yeah, that'll make for interesting reading at Starfleet Command. All right, all right. You win. But we still have a lot of work to do before you know, we single-handedly end the war and get promoted to Fleet Admiral. So let's get up to your ship and go after them. Right? Come on, let's go. One of the Klingon vessels is hailing us. Okay. Let's see what they want. On screen. Starfleet vessel. You are outnumbered and unable to flee. If you wish your crew to survive, stand down and prepare to be boarded. Refuse, and we will give you all an honorable death. Mm. Request. Denied. A warrior's death, then. Good. I wouldn't have it any other way. Perhaps we will meet face to face in glorious combat when I board your vessel to take it as my prize. Hmm. That will be the day. Red alert.
Get it. The defense satellites are back on our side. Nice. Good news, Captain. Latest sensor reports show oh. all Klingon vessels are either destroyed or retreating. I think we did it. Patch me through to Lieutenant uh, Kerwin here. Captain, all systems are clear over here. Not reading any Klingon ships on sensors either. Did we do it? Yeah, I think it's uh, because of the Xbox. Um, to be honest, yeah, uh, we did it, Lieutenant. But uh, we couldn't have done it without you, Captain. If it's all the same to you, I recommend we retrieve Lieutenant Kerwin and return to the Baran immediately. We haven't seen the last of Jula and her forces, and there is a nasty I'll have a look at the in-game settings uh, the in a little systems. bit. Yeah, thanks Seems for that. We have the solution to that little problem. I think it's high time we delivered it to Captain Lorca. Helm, laying a course, uh, Kerwin, uh, once Kerwin is aboard. Sounds like the Klingons are making another push in that sector. Securing Pryor's world is of the utmost importance, so I want you to render assistance to the Baran as soon as possible. I'm sending other vessels in the region to join the effort, but until they arrive, the burden will fall on your shoulders alone. Good luck and mm. Godspeed. Kensington out. Thank you, Admiral. I choose your rewards. Ah... Uh... Do you think energy, uh, armor, or phaser pulse rifle mark two? I've really got one of these, but I'd always give it to one of me, uh, one of my team. Mm. Congratulations! Oh, nice. 